Yo, what's up, beautiful people? How are you guys doing? It's your boy in Africa. For those who are new here, and, um, if you're new here, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and uh, like this video. Like this video, guys. And, uh, today, it's another day, it's another chance that we got to create this beautiful episode, guys. And uh, I'm in a certain place called Buyenzi, I mean Bujumbura, and this Buyenzi is a place where you can find a lot of Muslims in this whole city. I can, I can call it the most Islamic place in Bujumbura, because here, the population of this, this area, like more than 90% are Muslims, as you can see, that is a masjid or a mosque. Yeah, that is a mosque. Yeah, and uh, today is a Sunday. I'm just going to to tell you or to show you what to do in Buyens. And uh, actually, I forgot to tell you that this is the most busy. I mean, the busiest place in Ujumbura. People of this place are really, are really hustlers. They are really hustlers, guys. This is the busiest place in Bujumbura, as you can see, people are hustling. And uh, this is a place, I mean, I can call it a mechanic place. I mean, a mechanic place because whenever your car got damaged or whenever your car is having a problem, you have to take it here, you have to bring it here because the, I mean, almost all the cars of Bujumbura. When they get problems, they bring them here. So, as you can see, wherever you pass, it's a garage. It's a garage. There's garages everywhere, as you can see. Yeah, so if you're in Bujumbura and your, your car gets a problem, bring it in Buyenzi, guys. Bring it in Buyenzi. So, I'm just doing this video. I'm just. Uh, coming to take something from somebody so I decided just to show you how is Boyenzi and uh, this place that is called Boyenzi as you can see I told you this is the most Islamic place in Bujumbura this is another mosque here this is another, another mosque as you can see it's still under construction but People can pray in, and uh, other thing that is good for this place is that you can't get lost. If somebody gives you an address, if I tell you I'm here, you will never get lost because how this place is, you can tell you I'm um, I'm on First Avenue, Second Avenue. Third Avenue, this is how it's uh, drawn. I mean, yeah, this is how this city is. You can't get lost because people, I mean, uh, when he gives you an address, it will be just easy to find it because you go by counting. This is Avenue, first, I mean, the first Avenue, this is the second Avenue, this is the third Avenue, yeah, just like this. Just like that, so yeah. So, guys, I was saying this area, people of this area have unity. I mean, if you mess up with somebody from this area and they mess up with him here, I'm telling you, you'll be in trouble. You will be in trouble. I told you, wherever I pass, it's a garage, it's a garage. Yeah, this is a place where whereby you can find a lot of garages in this whole Bujumbura, guys. Yeah. Whenever you know you are, I mean, you want to, you want to travel, to be in trouble, just come and mess up with somebody from here, guys. Because they, they are like brothers and sisters. 
everybody, I mean, everywhere we find Buyen's person, just know that these people, they treat each other like sisters, like brothers. I'm just, I'm just lo still looking for the guy. Anyway, let me ask because actually it's, I don't know if it's here. Let me ask. This out. The monitor was called a no, what's going on? Yes, no, 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 Okay. Hello. Uh, guys, finally I got the guy. Ngumenga. Ndakwendi langa. So. So. The guy. I'm just coming here. I'm just coming here to tell. So guys, this is where your boy is sitting guys. This is where I'm sitting waiting for uh, waiting for the guy to give me those things. Yeah. Actually Can I feel what is that? Can I feel what is that guys? I will tell you, I will tell you when I get it. Yeah. I will tell you when I get it. Yeah. Anyway, let's wait for him. Let's wait for him until he comes and gives me. And uh, I mean, until he comes and gives me. Then, we'll go home. I'll go home because it's very sunny, it's very hot. I'm feeling very tired. I mean, I'm feeling very tired. Yeah. Guys, as I told you, I'm just going. I'm leaving. The guy gave me what I was coming to. Uh, I was coming to uh, to talk. Actually, let me tell you something. I mean, what I was coming to talk here in Bujumbura nowadays. We are experiencing. Sugar shortage. I mean shortage. We are having a sugar shortage. So, now, I mean, recently, uh, the government set it, set it how sugar will be given to the to the population. So nowadays, when. Uh, Sugar is out from the factory. There is a special delegation from the government that comes to distribute it. So, for me, I was spending many days without having sugar inside. So, um, there is a certain mom there. She's a good friend of mine. It's at a, it's it's a, in a in her shop that they dispute sugar so I told her that I I need the sugar and uh, I just paid money then she kept it for me so I was coming to take my sugar so as I told you I'm staying in Buyenzi and uh, there's a restaurant where I like to eat whenever I'm here and uh, that's where I come guys to take my lunch I'm coming to take my lunch today I don't know if I can show you yeah as you see
And uh, I forgot to tell you something, guys. If you want to enjoy food whenever on the Bermuda, I can assure you that this Buenzi is a place where people who, I mean, good cookers are here. This because I told you, I have ordered something and what to eat. This is uh, okay. It's made from maize. Yeah. I ordered this and the beans and the veggies. I'm still waiting for my veggies. Yeah. I just ordered uh, the veggies that called Amara. Here I caught it in the ring. I don't know if you know. If you have not been in the room. Yeah. I'm just waiting for my veggies. Then I will enjoy my food, guys. I will enjoy my my lunch. Anyway, welcome, welcome. Let me try this. This is how we eat. We just cut, then we put some beans like this. Then we eat. Mm. It's, this is meat. You can order your meat, your fried meat, that my brother here is doing. They just bring it and they choose for yourself what kind of meat you want. Yeah. Anyway, this is my veggies. This is my veggies. I eat like this, I put it here, then here. Yeah. Uh, this is. Let me enjoy my. Uh, yeah. It's you, you guys, you know me, I'm cheering. I'm just becoming West African. All the people who, from West, they're like a people, they're like a cheer. But they have a lot of seeds. Some people don't like, don't like, don't like. Chili with the seeds, guys. Yeah. Anyway, let me enjoy my food then. I'll be back after this, this, this lunch. Thank you. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> yeah. I'm done. As you can see, <coughs> it was very delicious. It was yummy. And then I don't know how much I'm, how much I'm going to pay. I'm waiting for <coughs> the beer. Guys, <coughs> as I told you, this boy is but. This place is uh, among the places where we find the houses of lower class, but uh, fortunately nowadays they are building it, people are constructing because our government told, told them that whenever you demolish your house, you, you don't, I mean you are not allowed to, to build it again if you, you are not able to, to build a building like this, that's why you see people are trying to construct a lot. People are trying to construct a lot in this place, guys. But I know, like, in the 10 coming years, it will be an area of high level buildings. Yeah, as you can see, it's just because I can't destroy other areas. Are consulting too much in this area. People are consulting too much, guys. Yeah. Now, this place is counted among the low class places, but soon it's going to be a VIP place, guys. Yeah, I'm still on my way. I'm still on my way. Going. I'm still on my way. Going back to home. Because I've got my sugar. Now I'm heading home, guys. I'm heading home. Yeah.
What I told you, wherever you pass, it's a garage. Wherever you pass here, in Boyens, you can't just walk like uh, 50 minutes, I mean 50 meters, without reaching a garage, guys. Yeah. Anyway, there's a lot of people here. I don't want to film people, so I think I can end my video here, guys. I can end my video here. It was just to show you this place called BNC. Yeah, as you can see, people are constructing. People are constructing, guys. Anyway, as I told you, there's a lot of people here. There's a lot of people. So, people think that I'm filming them, so. That's what I think about finishing my video, guys. Yeah. Oh well. Thank you for those who have already subscribed. And uh, if you haven't done it, please do it. Subscribe, like this video, share it, leave a comment, tell me what you want to see in Burundi. Because I'm a honest guy. I'm a honest guy. Whatever I want to see, I'll show you. I will make sure I show you guys. Yeah, so comment, tell me what you want to see in Burundi. Tell me what you know. I mean, you want to know in Burundi. I'm here just for you. I'm just here to show you. I'm just here to let you know what to do in Burundi. Yeah, I'm here to let you know what to do in Burundi. Yeah. Anyway, let me finish my video here, guys. Let's meet in another episode. Bye.